In this video, we'll demonstrate how easy it is to build a complete production BOM in Manufacturing Pro. We recommend watching our previous video where we demonstrate how to create a new template BOM by importing data from Microsoft Excel. In this tutorial, we'll go over how to create a new custom production BOM from the previous template bill of material. We'll begin creating the new BOM the same way we created the template BOM, only this time we'll choose New Production from the Production BOM folder. Like before, the BOM is currently empty. Only this time, instead of importing the data from an Excel document, we'll import it directly from our template BOM. To do this, we'll open our basic MITRESOT template BOM. We now have two BOMs open, an empty production BOM and a complete template BOM of our standard MITRESOT model. We can switch between them by clicking the respective tabs in the main file window. We can also rearrange the tab order by clicking and dragging them. Let's select the MITRESOT template BOM. Currently, the BOM is fully collapsed, showing only the top level. To expand the BOM and see its subassemblies and parts, click the plus icon next to the root. This expands the BOM to the next level. From here, further assemblies can For this be expanded demonstration, down our tree. customer has requested some modifications to their order. Some additional parts for the miter saw, which were not included in this basic model, will have to be added. We'll need to add a lower blade guard and a sliding base extension to the final BOM. We'll also need to replace the standard imperial table fence assembly with a metric assembly version. Before we begin adding assemblies, let's copy the basic miter saw assembly to our newly created production BOM. There are several ways to do this. The easiest way is to right click and copy the entire miter saw template BOM. We can now paste the copied assemblies into our new production BOM by selecting the BOM, right-clicking, and hitting Paste. The newly copied assemblies inside this production BOM are no longer linked to the original BOM template. This means that any further assembly modifications that are made to this production BOM affect only this BOM. In our next video, we'll demonstrate how to add further assemblies to our production BOM and sync the pricing with Business Vision accounting software. Thanks for watching.